Robson. So the ninth Melbourne derby is underway. Broxham, who was terrific against Sydney FC in the Big Blue last weekend. Finding Thompson, who gets away from Walker, slips it through for Broxham. The goalkeeper, wonderful stop. Cat-like reflexes by Nathan Coe. As Archie Thompson drives forward and is uh, brought down in rather crude fashion by Patrick Gerhardt, who picks up the first yellow card of the derby. Thompson. Seleski. Broxham. Touched by Thompson. Traore. Trying to bend it. Four or five times the ball went. In his part of the field, he was outplayed by a Melbourne Heart opponent. He is coming into the game. Now Thompson. On sides. Flores. Thompson and Traore combining. Perfect. Flores. His was, and Thompson is onside. Great chance for the victory. It's Thompson! Hearts nemesis back to haunt them once again. The winner in the final minutes of the last derby. The opening goal of this one. Victory one up. Well, Melbourne Hart and their defence pushing up high to try and constrict the space for Melbourne victory to play. But he only needed half a yard, Marcos Flores, who picks up his first assist of the season. Dinks it over the top perfectly. The ball held up for Thompson, who judged his run perfectly. And the finish was perfect to match. Andrew Redmayne sprawling to his left. Thompson finds the back of the net. Melbourne victory are away. What a beautiful piece of work by the Navy Blues. And the most lethal man throughout the history of the Hyundai A-League strikes first blood here at Etihad. Certainly the most prolific goal scorer at this venue is 24th at Etihad Stadium. Meantime, it's broken for Flores, who feeds Thompson. And he just pulls his shot wide. Good chance to make it too, though. Yeah, really good chance. Might have expected more of himself, Archie Thompson. They're just wobbling at the moment. Beautiful work again from Flores to Thompson. Too much space. The players that let it run, perhaps. Gamano would have been through one on one with Nathan Coe. The Tanich didn't realise. Flores trying to cushion it into the pack. But it's about not disrupting your midfield, which has been so effective with Mark Milligan anchoring that. Rest. This is Seleski, who got caught from eight. Why shouldn't it? Their team leads, courtesy of Archie Thompson. Here is the goal scorer. Looking to run at Jeremy Walker, he goes past him and sells in the dummy and then tries to beat Redmayne at the near post. Clever idea, gets a corner. And it is victory who get us back underway at the start of this second period. Melbourne victory, taking the lead in a game for the 10th time this season in the A-League. And of course now plays in Germany, that's a deft touch by Brew, just too much pace on it for Thompson. Thompson, touch back for Brew. A little bit congested down that uh, far touch line. Matt Thompson with the uh, captain's armband. No Simon Colosimo, of course, or Fred. Tonight, the uh, normal captain for Hart. Was easy for Co. Now Rojas in space, and with a chance to run at goal. That could spell problems for the Hards. Just for once, his touch is rather off. Brew again, Galloway continues the run. Rojas with the corner. 
Peru looping high S. Milligan back into the danger zone. Hartley to get it away quick. It's Thompson on the spin. And it's just over the crossbar. He only needs half a chance, Archie Thompson. And Melbourne Hearts presented him with one here. Yeah, he's sharp as attack at the moment, Thompson, with an appetite to match. And dithering defending from Melbourne Hart. And nearly paid the ultimate price. Frankovic finding Babal, but uh, he's not in it straight into the path of Thompson. Combines with Seleski. Now Brew. Flores. Good football by Victor. Garcia. Didn't quite dig the ball out from uh, between his feet. Rattled the crossbar in the dying stages of the first half. Seleski. Now Thompson's away. Oh, he's offside. Spin from Flores to stop. Thompson could round it up and finish with a plop. Seleski just pokes it forward. Thompson in towards Rojas. Oh, he just couldn't take it in his stride. As they're just loving it. Thompson gliding as though on air. Taking a seat on the turf. Quite sure what his problem is. He's been told to get back up and mark David Williams. And sharp is too by Ange Postecoglou and Kevin Musket. Their fans would simply love them to drop salt into the heart wounds. Thompson. Oh, lost his footing. Broxham finding the space between the two heart players for Brew. Now Thompson. Cutting inside with purpose and menace. Seleski, who's hit the post once today. It's all coming from the red and white quadrant beneath us at the moment. Victory just rocked on their heels. Melbourne victory still protected by the scoreboard advantage they've earned. And here they go again. And Roas is free in the middle of Thompson could pick him out. It's Roas! Good save by Redmayne again. Here's Thompson again. Space has started to appear. Rojas waits in the middle. And again, Redmayne is the right to bring it clear. Thompson, look how deep the uh, victory striker is trying to lend a hand. And he slaloms past the defender. Beautiful stuff by Archie Thompson. And sends Rojas a bit wide. He's done well to keep it in play. And links up with Flores. Only those three. Thompson. He's managed to get clear of two defenders. Cuts it back for Zaleski. Then leaves it a bit short for... Thompson, drop of the shoulder, and he'll uh, tease it into the path of Triore. He'll try and return it to him. Thompson leaps, and it's tipped over by Redmayne. Another good stop. Well, the first time this evening, 86 minutes in, that Adama Triore has got into a crossing position. And he dropped it over nicely. Thompson rose really well, and so did Redmayne, to see Thompson's headed effort clear. Was a vital intervention by Galloway. Absolutely crucial. And a good ball, too, to release Thompson. Without a sparring partner, Rojas now, of course, but he's drawn the foul from Mitchinson. And he gets a yellow card for his troubles, too. Well, those 34 year old legs just refuse to stop. Incredible from Archie Thompson. And Mitchinson. to come at home though next weekend for the Hearts Seleski releases Thompson Thompson in no rush waits for Stella to come towards him attempted wall pass the four minutes of stoppage time almost up what about that for a ball from Milligan picked out Thompson beautifully here's Archie Thompson this could finish it and he too hits it the roar is from 